Hey guys, Matt from Ultimate City Source. Today I've got a video for you guys of the default cases, uh, all 12 of them. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Actually, that's only five for the iPhone 3G and 3GS, but I think I've actually lent one to my friend. I think. Oh, no, no, one of them's on, on the iPhone. Wow, I'm stupid right now, guys. Okay, uh, so anyways, uh, let's just get started with the iPhone 4 one. So, the iPhone 4 one, as you can see, is a, like a perforated case. It is a very nice fit and finish. You can see I just snapped this one quickly so it didn't snap completely. You can see you can still see the silver antenna band right there. Um, full access to all the buttons. Full access to the dock connector. However, this will not work with the Apple dock. This will work with iHomes, as I have tried it with mine, without a dock adapter, though. So, guys, you can see the chrome letters kind of still show through. There is no camera reflection. The f flash will not be reflected back into your camera shots, which is definitely a very good thing. You also have open access to the top part, which is another very easy thing. Easy to lock with one hand. You can see full control over it still. Very easy, very nice. So, let me just show you guys some of the other colors. While I try to get that off mine, let's show you using Alex's. And I have to thank Alex, guys, by the way, for doing all the video work right now. He's the one, like, doing the camera guy part. That's the baby blue. Snap this off his. All I did was push the record button. Yeah, but he's done the record button so far, and any tap to focus thing that could be done. So, and he just felt like doing something. So, then there's this lime green case, like lemon green or lime green. Uh, I call it electric green. Who knows? Whatever. Um, let's pop this case off. You can see, guys, these cases do fit very well on the phone. Like, do come off when you need them to, but not when you don't. Then there's this red. Kind of uh, droid incredible reddish. So yeah, red. You can see you don't see the dots so super well through it. You still see the silver antenna band and all the normal stuff. You just pop this off real quick. Throw that case aside. Purple, like Barney purple. <laughs> uh, yeah. So apparently there was supposed to be a pink one, but instead they sent me Barney purple. So, whatever. <laughs> Just snap this off, guys, real quick. You see, just all in your finger now. And then the one everyone thinks it's a white iPhone for some reason is the white perforated look, which you do see the black very well. Uh, of You don't see the silver antenna band as much, but still very good. So, throw his iPhone aside, throw my iPhone aside, because we don't need that anymore. We're moving on, guys. Okay, so you can see this is my sister's 3G and 3G slash 3GS. You can see it's a black case that's not perforated. Very nice though. Um, still full access to top, access to the bottom. However, uh, obviously it's just, there's no flash, no camera reflection. Um, there are some downsides to this case, guys. Um, I was going to say, the last case didn't have any downsides really. Um, this case does have some downsides, though. some shortfalls, as you can call it. Um, one is the volume button is kind of hard to hit like with this case is like from here you can't hit the volume button as you can see I can't hit the volume button you actually have to kind of turn the phone kind of use your fingernails for it kind of click like that got any. um yeah if you've got any um but yeah the one of the things I want to address though real quick is that some of these cases do kind of put like my friend had this red one on his 3G slash homemade 3GS and it did kind of put a tiny bit of paint, right, like red paint on his phone, like right there in that corner. But it did come off, I got, like with just like wiping it off real quick. Um, so it's not bad. Uh, some of these cases are chipping though. I don't know if you guys can see that real quick. Let me just see if I can turn that up. Let's see. I apologize, guys, real quick. Let me just focus on that. But it is chipping right here, kind of. Um, they said that I emailed them about this, and they said that it is a known problem that is being addressed about it uh, apparently it's just a problem with the cases being over like overdone here is the pink case yeah my opinion very girly but for any girls watching let's do it and see the green case very leprechaun green style I don't know uh, whatever you want to call it and then guys these all look great with no matter what phone you have they do only currently have these for iPhone 3G 3GS only at the moment and iPhone 4 um, more cases will be coming soon. Now, guys, this is one of the last problems with this. You can see, I, right, like, probably 10 seconds before the video started, I took this case off my phone, 
or off my sister's phone, you can see it cracked. So, I mean, guys, these cases are a penny, though. Like, for a penny, there's no problem with these cases, though. Let me snap this back on. You can see my sister's been using this case and has stuck some stickers on it. But, yeah, very nice color. And then, last but not least, you get the white one. And that's a very nice looking case. Very cool looking. You can see it looks like I just need to take some like a wet paper towel or something and wipe this off because some of the red paint did get on it. Um, which is obviously is a shortfall of the white is that it does get dirty fast. But other than that, guys, you can see these cases look great. So guys, no matter what eye device you have, um, it does look great. So remember to like, comment, subscribe. Go check out default case uh, in the link below. Check out my giveaway. Um, my giveaway there will be an annotation like above when the video is up. So there'll just be a long annotation saying click here. Uh, so click there and you will see the giveaway. Uh, so like, comment, subscribe for more. See you guys.